addition of integers using algebra tiles. Welcome to my math class, Mathematics Made Easy. Click like and subscribe. What is an integer? An integer is a set of whole numbers and negative numbers excluding fractional numbers. Or it is the set of positive numbers, negative numbers, and zero. Examples of positive numbers. 1, 5, 7, 25, 42, 100, and so on. Negative numbers. Negative 1, negative 3, negative 7, negative 36, negative 42, negative 121, and so on. Zero is neither positive nor negative. The blue, green, and yellow are positive tiles. The red are negative tiles. To illustrate addition of integers, we will be using the unit tiles or one style of the algebra tiles, or we call it the small square tiles. Addition of integers with like signs. Example number one, positive three plus positive two equals blank. We have three yellow tiles plus two yellow tiles equals five yellow tiles. Example number two, positive six plus positive seven equals blank. We have six yellow tiles plus seven yellow tiles is equal to 13 yellow tiles. Some more examples and addition of integers with like signs. Example number three, negative six plus quantity negative three equals blank. We have here six red tiles to represent negative six and three more red tiles. We're going to add them. That would be nine red tiles. We have negative nine. Example number four. Negative eight plus quantity negative nine equals blank. We have eight red tiles and nine red tiles. So we have 17 red tiles all in all. So to add them, we have negative 17. To add integers with like signs without algebra tiles, add the integers and copy the common sign. Examples. A, positive 12 plus 24 equals 36. B, 105 plus 28 equals blank. It's 133. Example C, negative 32 plus quantity negative 15 is equal to negative 47. Example D, negative 63 plus negative 42 is equal to negative 105. Addition of integers with unlike signs. Example number one, negative 8 plus 5 equals blank. We have 8 red tiles to represent negative 8 and five yellow tiles to represent positive five. To add integers with unlike signs, we take away by pair the red tile and the yellow tile. So one, two, three, four, five. So what is left? We have three red tiles. So negative 8 plus positive 5 is equal to negative 3. Example number 2. 8 plus 
quantity negative 5 equals blank. If you notice, the numbers are the same from number 1, only that the signs are interchanged. We have 8 yellow tiles to represent positive 8 plus 5 red tiles to represent negative 5. Just like in example number 1, we will take away by pair the yellow tiles and the red tiles. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Three yellow tiles are left, so 8 plus quantity negative 5 is equal to 3. Example number 3. 10 plus quantity negative 4. We have 10 yellow tiles to represent positive 10 plus 4 red tiles to represent negative 4. Just like in examples number 1 and 2, we take away by pair the yellow and red tiles. 1, 2, 3, 4. We have Yellow tiles left. We're going to count. We have 6 yellow tiles. Therefore, 10 plus quantity negative 4 is equal to positive 6. To add integers with unlike signs without using the algebra tile, find the absolute value of the integers, change the operation to subtraction, and copy the sign of the integer with the larger absolute value. Example A. Negative 7 plus 3 is equal to the absolute value of negative 7 plus the absolute value of 3 is equal to 7 minus 3. Therefore, negative 7 plus 3 is equal to 4. Take note. The absolute value of an integer is always positive. Example B, 14 plus negative 5 is equal to the absolute value of 14 plus the absolute value of negative 5 is equal to 14 minus 5. So 14 plus the quantity negative 5 is equal to positive 9. Example C, negative 23 plus 8 is equal to the absolute value of negative 23 plus the absolute value of 8 is equal to 23 minus 8. Negative 23 plus 8 is equal to negative 15. Take note, the absolute value of an integer is always positive. We were able to derive the rules for addition of integers. To add integers with like signs, add the integers and copy the common sign. To add integers with unlike signs, find the absolute value of the integers, change the operation to subtraction, and copy the sign of the integer with the larger absolute value. Thank you for watching my math class, Mathematics Made Easy. Don't forget to click like and subscribe. Thank you and see you next video.